Hey there everyone so today LLMs are absolutely doing a phenomenal work they are absolutely saturating the benchmarks and absolutely reaching phd levels but what will happen in the future will LLMs be able to reach agi well this is what Ian Lacun has to say who is one of the godfather of ai and chief scientist at meta ai by the way thanks to alex let's see what he has to say we are not going to get to human level ai by just scaling up LLMs this is just not going to happen okay that's your perspective is no way okay absolutely no way um and and whatever you can hear from some of my uh more adventurous colleagues uh <laughs> it's not going to happen within the next 2 years there's absolutely no way in hell to you know pardon my french um the you know the idea that we we're, we're going to have you know a country of genius in a data center that's complete bs right there's absolutely no way so you heard him he says that there's absolutely no way that LLMs will be able to reach AGI but this is what Ilya Satskavar has to say who was the chief scientist at OpenAI and now is working on his own company Safe Super Intelligence he is one of the highly respected AI scientists and one of my personal favorites let's see what he has to say slowly but surely or maybe not so slowly AI will keep getting better and the day will come when AI will do all of our all the things that we can do not just some of them but all of them anything which i can learn anything which any any one of you can learn the ai could do as well how do we know this by the way how can i be so sure how can i be so sure of that the reason is that all of us have a brain and the brain is a biological computer that's why we have a brain the brain is a biological computer so why can't a digital computer a digital brain do the same things This is the one sentence summary for why AI will be able to do all those things. So you heard him. He says that if a biological computer, a biological brain can do that, then why not a digital computer, a digital brain which also has neural nets be able to do that? So you can see these are two very contrasting ideas and different perspectives on large language models. But is this still a question? Can LLMs do discoveries, new research? Well, actually, they may already have done it. You may have heard recently about Alpha Evolve, which is a Gemini-powered coding agent, which has actually found out a lot of discoveries and new algorithms in Max and coding. Let's look at some of them. So, in the article of Alpha Evolve, they are mentioning that Alpha Evolve found an algorithm to do complex scalar multiplications. which has improved an algorithm which was known as the best in this setting and to further test alpha evolve's performance they gave it 50 open problems in mathematical analysis geometry combinatorics and number theory and various other things and in 75% of the cases it rediscovered state of the art solutions and in 20% cases it improved previously known best solutions so these are real discoveries that alpha evolve has done so how was it able to do that well it turns out the models that were used were gemini flash and gemini pro we already know and use these models so what was done is a lot of solutions were generated with the help of these llms and they were evaluated so the core thinking and researching was done by these models so we are already seeing llms actually helping out to find novel solutions by the way it's very nice to see elias its cover after a long time what do you think about this guys will llms be able to reach agi do tell me down in the comment sections and i'll catch you guys in the next one